Yo, what's up guys? It's me, PMA Pro. And today we're gonna be doing something really fun. We're gonna be playing Gorilla Tag's new horror mode. Now this mode was made by Nacho Engine, so thank you to him. And we're gonna be seeing what it would be like if Gorilla Tag really had a horror mode. It's set in mines and the monster is terrifying. There is an end goal, so I'm gonna try and beat it by myself. And I'm also gonna be beating it with some friends to see how hard it really is. And if you guys do wanna learn how to download this mod for yourself, so that y'all can play with your friends definitely watch to the end of the video because i show you guys exactly how to do just that so if y'all do like the video definitely consider hitting that subscribe button as you guys know it does help a lot other than that though let's just get straight into the video Okay, so we're first just gonna try and beat this by myself. As y'all can see from the description, it says, in the Phantom Spider Den, flee the giant spider through webs while collecting it three crystals. Basically, you have to collect three crystals and escape. So all I gotta do is step into this portal and the game mode starts. Kinda scared. Well, forgot to press enter, my bad. Whee! Oh, nah. Okay, we're in. I gotta put my wristbands on so I don't fling my controller around. Look at the ground, dude. It's all spider webby too. Oh, hell nah. Oh, is that the spider? Is that the spider? I hear some creepy crawling. Oh, hell nah. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. That's it. Oh, nah. That's definitely. Ah! How fast is this guy? Uh, kind of fast. Okay, that's terrifying. Should we get jump scared by it? Should we? Okay, okay. He's fast <gasps> okay that's how you escape i'm guessing good to know okay we need to find three crystals to escape where are the crystals dude oh he's right there bro where are the crystals slow circle there war bro where are the crystals i think there's one in there but the spider is uh oh i'm trapped oh shoot screw it kill me gang <gasps> Oh my god, that was terrified. All right, let's try this again. Yup. Okay, we're back. Okay, we need to... So, like, I think this is a crystal right here, right? I don't know. How do I collect them? Was that a crystal? Yeah, it was, but I didn't know that. So, feel free to laugh at me over the course of this video. I hear the spider coming. Spiders are my worst fear, bro. I need to know where he is so I can run. Okay, there he is. There he is. There he is. Hello, buddy. Crystal, 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 crystal. Is that another one? Wait, no, it's that one? Huh. Please. How do I collect it? How do I. Ah! ah! How do I escape? How do I escape? I need to escape. I need to escape. Okay, bud. He's trying to corner me. I think there's one in here, but if I go in here, I die. No! Can I juke him out? Juke! Ah! Oh my gosh. Dang it, bro. Okay, let's try again. Okay, guys, so after researching it, the crystals are the things you have to touch, and they make a sound when you collect them. Oh, hell no. Are you serious, bro? Hear me out. Okay, you know what? Okay, guys, we're back. Okay, so now we know what to do. I did it! I did it! I did it! I hear him, I hear him, I hear him. No, my camera! Okay, let's go this way this time. There's lights. Oh, yes! Oh! Another one! One more? Please! Okay, I think I did it, right? Please, please, please! No! We're speedrunning this. I recognize the spawn. One's here. Boom! Please! Please! Ah! Don't tell me it's just- What? What? Bro! Just take me, bro. Um, 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 um. You get a sentry! Please! Bro! No! Oh, God! This new POP is gonna help watch. No! Okay, guys. After numerous attempts, I still haven't done it. I've thought of a bunch of different techniques. And I think it's time I finally complete it. We know the spawns. Okay. Boom. One crystal. Down. We just can't die. Oh, my God. My we can't die over there. That's the goal, guys. That's the goal. Okay, there's the spider. Okay, okay. So he might be coming down this way. Oh no, he's stupid. He's stupid. He's stupid. He's stupid. He's stupid. You dumb or something. Wait, can I juke him? Okay, there. No, no, wait. Hear me out. Hear me out. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god. Oh my god. We did it. Guys, we did it. We need one more crystal. We need one more crystal now. Please, please. Hold on. No, is this it? I did I do it? Please tell me I did it. Please. Yes! Yes! We did it! 
No way. Dude, no way. I called it. Guys, I did it. I beat the horror mode. And I did not need the boy's help. Let's go. All right, guys. So I successfully finally beat the map. It took a little bit, but I beat the stupid spider. So now it's time that I teach you guys how to download it. All right, guys, so the requirements you're gonna need is obviously a PC, a Quest, or really any PC VR, PMA Pro sticker, a link cable, or any cable with USB-C, and that's about it. So here's how you download the mods. Okay, guys, so in this tutorial, I'm gonna be teaching you everything, including how to install Monkey Mod Manager, but all the mods will be linked down below to Nacho Engine's Discord, which is the guy that made the mod. But for all this to work, you are gonna need this, so here's how you install it. First, open up your preferred web browser and open up YouTube, type in my name and go to this video. And while you're there, might as well maybe hit that subscribe button. But anyways, once you're in the video, click the description and click the top link. And that should take you to this. So once you're on here, just scroll all the way down and click monkeymodmanager.exe. Then once it's here, you can drag that onto your desktop and simply double click it. Now, once you're on the screen, you're gonna wanna make sure Beppin X is checked, which it usually always is. Then scroll all the way down and click computer interface, Utila, and Newtonsoft. Once all these are clicked, click install slash update. Once you do that, you can close Monkey Mod Manager, open up Oculus, open up Steam. And yes, you are gonna need the Oculus app for this, although it's super easy to download. Literally just look it up and it'll take you like two steps to install it. And yes, you are also going to have to own the PC version of Gorilla Tech. So once you guys have all these things set up, you're gonna wanna grab your headset, grab your link cable and plug that guy in, and then plug the USB-C end into your headset. You'll know what's working when you go down here to devices and see that it is active. And if you don't see this at all, you are gonna have to click add headset and then do all this setup here, like continue, link cable, and set up your headset. But once that's all done, so you can then minimize this, go onto your headset, click Quest Link, and click Play. Or if you don't wanna do all that hassle, you could just click Play right now, open it up in Oculus VR mode, which is the best mode to open it up in. And then once you're in Gorilla Tech, you can simply just close it right back out. The reason why we did that was just so that all the files could be loaded. And you'll know it works when you click this gear icon, Go to manage and browse local files, and you should see a Beppin X folder with plugins and some of these folders here. So now that you have Monkey Mob Manager and all of its dependencies installed, you can now go back to the video and then click the video and go to the second link, which is Nacho Engine's Discord. Once you're in there, locate the files, download them onto your computer, and drag them onto your desktop. There should be two files that he links. It should be Gorilla Nav Mesh and Phantom Spider's Den. This is the mod that makes everything work, and then this is the actual map, like mines and whatnot. So once you have these two guys installed, you're then gonna wanna go back to the video and go to the third and final link, which is how to install Monkey Map Loader, which is how you'll actually be loading the map for this insanely fun game mode. So I'll click that link, and it should take you to this. Then go to Monkey Map Loader 1.2.2. Scroll down a bit until you see monkeymaploader.zip and click that. It's gonna be in your downloads folder here. It should be in your downloads, so then all you have to do is just drag this guy onto your desktop. Then once Monkey Map Loader is on here, and it should just say Monkey Map Loader by the way, it shouldn't have the one. So once you have this on your desktop, double click it, double click Bebin X, double click plugins, and just keep this window open to where it says Monkey Map Loader. Because from here, you're now going to want to double click Monkey Mod Manager, go to Utilities, go to Beppin X folder, double click Plugins, and then simply drag this Monkey Map Loader into the Plugins folder. And once that's dragged in, make sure you click Install slash Update. If you don't, nothing's going to be updated. But once you have that, you can then close everything, go back to Steam, go back to Oculus, run your Gorilla Tag, and then close it right away so that all the files are loaded. And once you've made sure that everything is loaded correctly, you can now go on to the third and final step, which is just simply installing these mods. So again, open your Monkey Mod Manager, go to Utilities, go to your Beppin X folder, double-click Plugins, and once you're in this Plugins folder, drag the Gorilla Nav Mesh into there. Once that's done, you can then double-click Monkey Map Loader, go to Custom Maps, and then drag the Phantom Spider's Den into your custom maps. You can then close this and again make sure to click install slash update so that everything installs correctly. And once that's done, you can now officially open up Steam and Oculus, run Gorilla Tag, and everything should be completed. 
You guys will know this works if you first have the computer interface, which is already a good sign. And then also if you have monkey map loader and monkey map hub browser. If you see everything, it means it worked. So now all you gotta do is click these arrow keys down to monkey map loader, click enter, click enter again. This should pop up. Then all you gotta do is enter, read the rules so you know what's actually going on, and then click enter again so it loads. Then all you do is step in that portal and boom, you're playing with the boys. And yes guys, this is multiplayer supported. Everyone just has to have a PC. Other than that though, that's the end of the video. Thank you all so much for watching. I super appreciate it. I will be making a video on the new cave soon as it is a huge W. But other than that, I love all of you guys. I've been me, you've been you. Peace out guys.